And welcome back to Press X for Chromosomes, where we are climbing the pagoda as promised. Hell What if we yes. just left? We went like, nah, never mind. I don't want these purple points. Yeah. We're good. <laughs> yeah, these are the only ones we do not get. Yeah. That we've specifically been like, we're totally going to get those. <laughs> yeah. There was, um, one of the videos I was editing, I saw purple coins as I was editing, and I was like, mm. <laughs> I'm going to have to get those. I'm going to have to fucking obtain. We, because I just ran right past it and I was just like god damn it god damn it me I guess I don't really consider this a turret well cause you got the uh I know it has like turrets on it but it's still like more of a pagoda then that's a turret and like pagoda shaped turret well turrets in fucking um architecture designs are like those like stupid like gazebo type things that are on like fucking um they're not gazebos but you know like there's like hexagon portions that are sometimes on houses they're very Victorian mm. those are turrets right 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 so, so I was just like everything about this I mean at least in the modern world the English world uh -huh. isn't uh not really a turret. I think it's just yeah, that's just tips. Right. I mean for me, whenever I hear turret, I think of um like the weapon. Yeah. Which like I said, it does have it, but the, I, it's not really a turret either. Well, hey, we're here at the shop. <laughs> it's like purple coins. <laughs> As you fly away. Yeah, as we were flying away, I saw the purple coins. I was like, God. Eh, oh. Oh, he probably shows up after I... Wait, no, hang on. Yes, here we go. Fucking creepy ass. <laughs> Statues. I see they're they're there not that go. bad. One of us. One of us. Get into your spot, dingus. There we go. I couldn't remember if it was like one of those things of like when you hit it, it goes, or if you have to line it up correctly, or if you put it in and then pop out, it goes. So. Oh, yeah. I thought you just had to set them up, but I couldn't remember. I think you have to just set them up. There we go. Wild. Who would have thought? Now that I understand the instructions. Well, the Thank you. That, the thing that's nice about this game, it does kind of make you think outside the box, too. Like, once yeah. you learn the mechanics, it becomes kind of simple. But, like, it, it does still try a lot of shit. And I mm -hmm. like how there's people, like, <laughs> like there's tourists around in yeah. every area. I actually forgot to go back and talk to the, um, uh, the one guy who had his car stuck in ice. I forgot to go talk to him back on the desert. Because, mm -hmm. um... He starts the whole tourist quest where you just go and you find him and his charge in every single world. Mm -hmm. And they'll give you hints about which world they're going to go to next. Um, and same with the Sphinx. The Sphinx, I know where it is in a couple different levels. Um, and one of them, you have to use the binoculars. Oh, yeah. yeah I mean, do you... Do you need to use the binoculars for some things, or like, can you just like because you have the knowledge? It is literally knowledge on how to find that one sphinx. That's fair. Um, I never would have found it. You, like, I think maybe uh, Takatu tells you how to get it. Mm -hmm. Um, like gives you like the hint of like, hey, maybe it's in the sky, and so you look. Um, but I think I actually just Googled it because I was like, I don't know where the fuck this is. Yeah. Let me in. I look like a samurai. Thank you. Bye. I will say that it's nice in the modern day and age to have Google. <laughs> Instead of just like have to buy a game fact. Yes. Like, or like a manual or I think the last time I bought a manual was for Dragon Age 2 and that's just because it looked cool. That's fair. And then I was like, why to buy this? <laughs> yeah, that's me with like a lot of, um... Like art books, almost. Yeah, I'm. See, I will actually like read about like the stuff. I'll read their articles. 
almost. I stood on air for a minute. I really like this actually. 2D section because of the fucking like folding f mm -hmm. the <laughs> screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna say partition, but you know, screen is definitely partition the word. is actually probably also the correct term. That's the white people term. Right. And those ones are like lacy and have patterns on them. Yep. Damn it. Animal Crossing definitely made me go. Kind of want to like a partition like that now. Yeah. But like, where would it go in here? Where would you put it? Yeah. That's something for like a home. Right. That's something for like. Like, if I get a place that has a big enough room, mm -hmm. I might do that for like, okay, well, this is my computer. Yeah. And then Not over here barrier. is going to be like a reading nook. Yeah. Good point. Alright. Right. Because you can't throw Cappy to help you get Ooh. it. Oh, right. Which is generally what I'll do if I'm running out of time, so I'll just throw Cappy. Yeah. Yeah, okay, this is what I was thinking of. I was like, I, I hope I didn't fuck that up. No, I just need this. And then you jump on. And, and you push again. <laughs> Good enough. It works. There we go. I can make it in because I'm two blocks high. Yeah, right. I Me think being surprised that Minecraft, you're only like three or two blocks high. I think you're two, because Endermen are three. Are you only two? Because I think you can, I think you, if you, no, no, four, four blocks means that you have like this room over your head and three makes it feel like you're fucking like, you're like super like scraping across the, yeah, scraping across the ceiling. Yeah. Yeah, I, I remember, think it is two, because it's like, it's always shorter than I expect, because mm -hmm. I think you should be three. I always, um. Being like legs, torso, head accidentally make myself like a house that's only three tall and then like as soon as I'm like done building the roof I'm like oh god damn it so I have to like adjust everything <laughs> up one yeah and it sucks. it sucks if you have multiple levels too uh-huh which I've done that before on a multi-level area and I've just been like you know what this okay. is how I live yeah scraping my head against the ceiling yep. it's like real life for you basically <laughs> you're like whatever I'm used to this feeling I <sighs> It is. It was really funny going to Japan and then just like going through one of those gardens that had like the um Short. the the hut. The sh yeah, that you could basically s yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no fucking. Uh, I was oh. I was just thinking about because people are talking about like. I don't remember, but it was like a thread that ended up talking about Japan. Somebody was talking about how they um went with their um like friend who's like seven foot. Oh my god! And, and people literally just stop you if you're super fucking tall. And take pictures with you because it's like ridiculous height to them. Right. And fucking like. Seven feet. Yeah. And well, somebody was like six foot and still getting pictures. And like, because someone was like, oh shit, am I gonna. They're like, I'm gonna be tall, being like five, seven. They're like, actually, you'll be kind of around average out right. there. Like, because people are like that tall. But like, um, yeah, no. <laughs> I was like, meanwhile, I felt I was still somehow shorter than the average like Japanese woman. It <laughs> yeah. felt like I was like, come on, man, I'm only five foot two. It was definitely the thing of when we get separated, you look for me and I just stand in one place. The yeah, the only thing that works for me is that m Where like my fucking whiteness and hair color. Right. So I think I had gone back to fucking my like brownie red. You did, but that didn't entirely help when. A lot of people just had like darker hair. Yeah. And I was like looking around and I'm like, God, I'm. Well, so then we're in like the areas that have like a more dyed hair. Yeah. Stuff like that because it's like Tokyo and like Shinjuku and all the places that like you that are like celebrating diversity. Yeah. <laughs> Tokyo Tower, all these places that oh, just like gosh. tourists are at. I can't wait to go back. It was nice. Being a little concerned about how people are going to view my tattoos. Yeah. And then also, but people were super nice. And the one thing I, I just like, 
the two people that I really think, like, that I was just like, this is, like, really nice. It was, like, the two, like, the one older man that tried to help us. Yeah, and find our, make sure we were taking the right, right like, train. Yeah, yeah, and then the, um, the guy in the cigar shop that helped oh, me. Oh, yeah, they were super nice. Yeah, it was super nice. I was like, that's, it's super nice, and they probably recognize that I'm, like, white tourist very clearly, like, right. I, like, they're probably, like, she, like, Irish or fucking <laughs> Scottish, <laughs> but, like, fucking, and, but, like, I tried to be as respectful as possible, mm-hmm. and fucking, I just, and they were just super nice back, so I hope yeah. that they fucking didn't feel offended, or, or had at least patience for the fact that I'm of a different culture. Right. But, like, I've always been a little bit more worried about the older generations, because, you know, wars and things, and, like, but they were super nice, and I was like, people are nice. Yeah, I remember there was the one guy, too, that helped us out with, um, the ramen, the ramen shop. Oh yeah, he was. I was we... Half of me was kind of wondering if he was super excited to test out his fucking English skills. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I was like, this is a free course for you, isn't it? <laughs> and then that's where he discovered that uh, the Japanese have uh, no heat tolerance. I mean, I mean, oh, they right. have they have all the heat tolerance. Is what I mean. What I mean by no heat tolerance is that heat does not affect them. Right. Because like they would spicy. order. No, not spicy just temperature wise they would oh. fucking remember they would get their ramen instantly and, and slurp it down it. and that shit was like boiling yeah 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 throw your stamp on the ground I can't ever remember with this one if it's like a kill these guys or if it's a have them break all the blocks oh well cause there's one there's one later where it's like you need them to break them okay I did get it um, where you need them to break certain blocks, mm-hmm. and if you kill them, obviously you can't do that. Yeah. So I couldn't remember if this was it or if it's something later. I feel like it's this just because you broke all the blocks already, or nothing happens. There or there we go. Just took or a minute. Maybe you have to do all of that, break and kill. Uh, let's see. No, just kill them. That's yeah. Half of me is just wondering if, like, track these back. are, like, Japanese words that fucking they didn't have, like, a good, like, s- comparison for. Like, a, not technically a translation, so they're just, like, uh, ogres. Well, <laughs> I'm wondering if they're technically supposed to be oni. Yeah. Well, you could just... Yeah. I, but, like... Uh, could you say demon, but... Uh, yeah, because that's technically what the te- translation yeah, is. Yeah, but I guess fucking e. Maybe that's... Maybe it's too <laughs> critical on, like, knife... Like, knives. Yeah. yeah. Yep, the wedding's almost here. The boss is getting ready and the keep up ahead. But you, you can scram because you're definitely not invited. But here's my invitation. Oh. <laughs> What's either? It's like done in crayon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's like really clearly forged, but they're like not intelligent enough for that. Excuse you? Yeah, I don't think you can hit her. She has spikes in her helmet. I think you have to fucking play her game. Yeah. She's like, no, my beautiful, my, my, hands. my beautiful hair that I did. I mean, I understand. I feel that shit. You dropped that right on top of me. Yeah, man. Right up again. Yeah, I was gonna say it's just kind of a bad position. Fine, do your big one. Bro. I haven't had these ones in so long, I forgot how to how hit did you, her. How'd you get hit by that? You were literally in between. I think... Stop that. Get down here. Noxious. Um, I was doing a dungeon uh, with my on 14 mm-hmm. and um there's like a mechanic that's kind of like this mm-hmm. where you have to like freeze an enemy with the boss mm-hmm. and then later when it starts to charge up something you hit a snowball at it turns out they're directional i did not know that so <laughs> no one was at the other snowball i hit it it goes sideways and we're all like shit 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 it's like running. and i'm like i'm so sorry i didn't know it's directional and they're like honestly we forgot that it was directional too so it's <laughs> not a big deal <laughs> <laughs> that's fair <laughs> the boss wasn't kidding when he said you two 
you're you two are persistent. They use weird like contractions. contractions yeah. yeah. Cause is that a contraction? Or is that conjunction? I can't. It's a contraction. Conjunction, junction, what's your function? <laughs> <laughs> but I owe it to the family, to all the brutals to come at y'all with everything I got. My turn. Because you've murdered the rest of my kin. Until later, at least. I got three hats. Hey, yeah, but I'm just gonna smack you around. My three hats. <laughs> Wanna come at me? Do it. I dare you. I don't need it. Anyway. So I started smacking. So I sat on your head. Mm -hmm. I think technically. I mean, watch this be Switch's showcase of how many things we can have on the screen at one time. <laughs> Meanwhile, fucking. Like, I remember, like, Xbox Ones. Like, Showcase was like, look how many zombies we can have in Dead Rising on the screen at oh, one time. Yeah, and yeah, it was like yeah. a fuck ton. Uh, so I'm just. <laughs> Nintendo's always, like, five years behind everyone else in terms of fucking console ability. And they're coming out with, like, Switch Pro, probably. <laughs> Soon. No, Switch like, Plus. No, literally. Oh, seriously? Yeah. But, oh. Like, we don't know if it was, like, real or faked, but, like,. It's fun in this day and age. Everything gets leaked eventually because someone's website fucks up. Right. And so, like, someone accidentally didn't, like, in Indonesia or somewhere, uh, accidentally uh, put up a, yeah, like... A listing. A listing for Switch Pro that could be in pre-order. And people are like, oh, so I'm wondering if there's fucking going to be announced a Switch Pro E3. Yeah. I mean, that's how we learned that the Mass Effect was getting a remaster. Was... Oh, yeah. It was a leak. Yeah, it was somebody... It was, like, fucking, like, epic. Or it was, like, like a... Uh, like origin or something had yeah. like <laughs> oops like put it up temporarily in canada no it was right. like walmart yeah and like put it up temporarily same with like borderlands 3 yeah it's the same shit every single time it's just like maybe maybe just maybe don't put it in your system yeah maybe just fucking don't tell people until the day of say hey yeah. it's gonna be released it, it, say it wait to say hey this is going to be releasable. But I understand probably for marketer reasons why they want to have it. Because uh, right. it'll be new and people will try and jump on it right away. Build hype. Yeah. But, I mean, you could just take the route of saying, yeah, I um, don't. Like, it's it's, to, it's a new thing and uh, it'll be available on this day. Right. And then you can give that listing to all the freaking people at that point. Yeah, it doesn't need to be... You don't need to give it super months in advance, but like I said, I understand it's probably marketing. What's that fucking instrument? Somebody on the instrument going ape shit. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I, I, I don't know the name of it though. Yeah, I would look it up, but also I don't want to like listen to things right now on camera. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. Cause I'd have to listen to it to like know. You could always maybe you could do um, Bowser's Kingdom. It, it's already. I've thought about that. It's gonna be too wordy. That's that fair. YouTube's gonna or not YouTube. Google's gonna be like, do you mean information I don't give a shit about right. or fucking no one's asked that question exactly. Right. So I'm just not gonna. So I'd rather just like remember the instrument. I'd have to type like classic like. Either I would try like a zither or a zitar mm -hmm. and see if it's one of those. And if it's not, I would instantly go to fucking like, is this a, um, like a, like classic, like Japanese instruments. Mm -hmm. I do remember. Cause they have it in Okami too. There was, oh, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, when we were in Japan, I think, I can't remember what park we were coming out of. Um, <laughs> went to a lot of perks. We did. That's why I can't hey, remember which one it was. It's, it's free content. Exactly. <laughs> and it's fucking. And, and we also went on their fucking national park day, so there was like a lot of people there. There were so many people. Um, it was the one that was near the school. Yes, um, I know which one. The like one, the tea garden. Right. Maybe. Because the one that we went to that was national park day, it was um. We had to take the bus to it, and it was in, like, a right. neighborhood. And then the one that was, like, by a school, I'm pretty sure, is the one with the 
the pagoda, the like the tea garden with the like bridges, and it wasn't raining that day. Like it wasn't the other place. Wasn't that the Meiji Temple though? No. Okay, then I'm confusing the Meiji Temple with the tea garden area. Um, like like I can pull up pictures of that one because I know what you, I think you're talking about. The okay. one by the school. Yeah, because I remember we were walking to the garden and we were like, we were like, oh shit, a school. Um, I was like, should I be here? And it just, for me, it was like, it felt weird because I was like, the school's like in such like a huge, like, I, I just was like, oh, this is a school. I'm used to schools being like, kind of like tucked away. Yeah. Whereas this one was like right next to like everything. But I remember as we were like, I think we were leaving the park. Um, it must have been after that first park we went to. The, the one on National Park Day. Yeah, it wasn't... It's wasn't the that the last park we went to? Yeah. Oh God, yeah it's the one that, that has the, that, that giant fucking... Um, uh, the the, the, the like, giant... Like the this one, the, the cherry tree. Right, yes. Um, but there's... Um, I know, right? Uh, but there was the one guy outside of it who had an instrument and was just playing. Because remember, there was, that, there was that, that market that was like right outside of it? Vaguely. Vaguely remember that. I, <laughs> I know I remember. Like, like here's like the little, like, it's more of the fucking lantern, but the little tea I love this lantern so much. I didn't like I know, you're busy. I Yeah, let me get out of here. Yeah, because that's where all the koi wa yeah. were. Yeah. Yeah. So. And then it's <laughs> at, that's, at, that's the one I remember being around. And school. then there was the duck brigade. <laughs> they were like, oh my god, you're feeding the koi? And you're like, and they, they just came running. And basically the seagulls and fucking the Nemo. Mine? Yeah. Mine, mine, mine. I you're like, this is for the fucking koi, you dickheads. I think this is the one I was talking about where... Was sparkling. Boom. Would have been disappointed if it was like a coin. I mean, coins do not sparkle like that, but that's why I would have been disappointed yeah. if it was a coin. Stop! Oh, I did. I get, I, mm. right. There we go. <laughs> Stretch. Not fling myself off into oblivion this time. Thanks. I will mindlessly walk towards you to kill you. <laughs> oh yeah, I also like this shit. All the fucking flags that are dancing around. Yeah, right. It's like a little upsetting at the same time for some reason for me because I think it's just like too much movement. It's a little panicky. Yeah, because they're very fast moving. But I like the music. Mm -hmm. And I also, uh, Captain oh, Toad, hey, Toad, how do you keep getting in these situations? Ah, the fucking bird. <laughs> I think you have to get rid of the bird. There we go. You have to be like a certain distance away. Yeah. It's. I think. Thank God. I <laughs> fucking. I saw you murder that thing. Good. <laughs> I was walking along these rooftops for so long, I got lost. But I found this power moon, so it's not bad at all. Wait for the optimism, Toad. I'm burning up. <laughs> All right, well... That's why, I'm fucking, which, why was I dying? <laughs> Do you want to scale the walls next time? Yes, I think that's a good idea. So I like the little, like, gold filigree with, like, Bowser's head right there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I didn't even notice that. God, yeah, the little even details. The, even on the little, like, the roof down below, if you walk back a little bit right there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The little, like, little stamps of, I own this. Yeah, exactly. God. I know, good little detail, details. man. But anyway, good place to stop. So until next time, bye. bye.